So this is Nemo Invex 2. Um, let's start at the beginning. We um, originally had a Nemo Invex 1, which was our original benchmarking tool. Very well respected in the market, very reliable. Um, but what we wanted to do was, we wanted to take the tool to the next level. So we listened to our customers, first of all. They had lots of input for us on what they wanted from the next generation benchmarking tool. So the first thing they wanted was a lot of capacity in the tool itself. So in this module here, in this chassis, we can fit up to 50 handsets onto one chassis. Mounted in, mounting the handsets onto the uh, what we call the pizza boxes up here to give us lots and lots of testing opportunities and lots and lots of testing capacity. So typically operators and benchmarkers can test lots of technologies, lots of operators and lots of services at the same time. The second thing was that our customers wanted to build on that class winning reliability that we had with Invex 1. So it's been built to military specification. What that means is all the connectors, everything inside is built to be ruggedized into really harsh terrain because we have these things in Africa, in the outback, in Australia, and we want to make sure that it works in all those conditions. Another thing is the usability that our customers wanted with Invex. They wanted to make sure that it was easy to install, to connect, and to supervise. So there's lots of really cool features in here that I personally like as well. We've got an interface module here that gives you lots of supervisories so that the operator can tell all the time what's happening with the system. Processing power is really important to us, especially with LTE technologies now. With some older systems, you can't get the data rates out of the system that you can with this. So all of these are USB 3 connectors. That means all of the carrier aggregation testing is covered with this beast here. Another thing, and it may not seem important, but our customers wanted it to look good. Well, you be the judge of this. You tell me if it looks good. I personally think it looks fantastic. Also, it's really, really modular. So you get the handset isolation, you get the processing in here, but also we've got things for holding the handsets, for combining for antennas that really make it modular. We've got things on the back like uh, backlighting, connection for scanners. So we think we've included all of those features that our customers want. And actually, our customers are already telling us that and they're voting with their wallets. 